there's so many ideas we've had in crypto over 10 plus years now that haven't been tested yet. In the Cosmos SDK, like we have ways to do all this. Like everything about it is configurable and feels configurable. Cosmos started out with some like pretty strong MEV and privacy takes. Back when we started, there was this untapped market of like there's no DEX for Cosmos assets. We want to make a DEX where we'd stop this MEV crisis where like let's do things at the protocol layer because we can change uh, tenement and do things as, an, as our own custom state machine you need to make MEV less possible. Uh, I've just been working on the stack for so many years and I think it just gives you such powerful configurability over what you can do. Like you're not really tied to a given execution model. You can easily add your own VM, you can uh, you know, parallelize stuff. Uh, you know, we could imagine switching to something that's like does zero knowledge proving or does like batching. We can make blocks more censorship resistant or more uh, by just having every validator contribute some data. We can do all sorts of like performance optimization that you see in ZKVM. You know, we, we can make MetaMask and Phantom work like directly with uh, any Cosmos chain like by virtue of just being able to configure what types of signatures are accepted. In the SDK, something that's really cool that we got figured out is that what are these hooks we can add into the consensus layer that will let the apps be able to get more out of consensus, like you know, get the validator sets to do extra work or to give you extra properties. And so I think just Cosmos gives you uh, the stack gives you this huge amount of configurability and like uh, iterability on uh, every part of the protocol, which is key. Like this should be the architecture for how we build blockchains. You know, it's cover the space of things from rollups to uh, you know full app chains. Let's figure out how we get all these app chains to talk to each other in a common language, share things like security, where I feel like Ethereum has this vision of, well, let's get one chain highly secure and then let people do whatever centralized or like semi-centralized things they want, but inheriting ETH security. Um, whereas I think in Cosmos, we can have a vision that's a little bit less centered around one thing. Like, let's have many different applications that are like, each have their own security properties that co-secure each other, which feels a little bit more like nations and a more robust system. I think it's the checks and balances of this that give us more secure systems or you know, give us anti-fragility everywhere. And so I, know, I guess in Cosmos, that's this mesh security idea. I also just imagine this being the place where because we have such high iterability on consensus on the state machine, it makes us like a great place to uh, have new ideas be experimented with like privacy techniques, uh, things like uh, fee models for users or uh, new VMs, uh, like, you know, it gets integrated into a full product with like wallet experiences and stuff much more easily than elsewhere. And then we get in this cross pollination of like, oh, since we're on this common tech stack, it's easy to import something from, uh, if one experiment goes really well, we can get this propagated everywhere. And this is just such a huge iteratability advantage.